Here, Albuquerque's animal welfare officers have to deal with rabid dogs, abused animals, some pretty depressing stuff. So this holiday season, they wanted to do something a little more cheerful. News 13's Amanda Goodman is live in the Newsplex with that story. Amanda? Well, Dean, instead of an office potluck or secret Santa, the two dozen animal welfare officers decided to sponsor a family in need. They collected money, bought toys, clothes, and even had a few items donated, like this crib and stroller. This afternoon, they presented the massive pile of gifts to an overwhelmed 21-year-old mother of two. Nicole Cayadito <laughs> used to be a family. She was able to find housing through the help of Noonday Ministries. She has two daughters, one year old Emberly, who you see here, and Cobain, who's just one month old. Cayadito is now enrolled at CNM, working toward a more stable future for her and her family, but they're still struggling. She didn't feel comfortable talking to us on camera, but says she was surprised and very thankful for the gifts. The officers were also surprised by the amount of items that came pouring in. I said, you know what? Just just do what your heart what your heart feels and uh Obviously, you can tell there's there's a whole table full of gifts. And this was the first time the officers from the field services division have ever done something like this. Dean? Very nice thought, Amanda. Thank you very much. Animal Welfare chose Noonday Ministries to find a family because one of their officers works closely with the shelter.